So, hey, y'all. I came by super duper duper quick. I don't know why there's a shine. Hold on, excuse me. Okay, it's still there. <laughs> Dirty mother. Um, so, it's still there. Fuck it. So, y'all, tell me how I'm listening to the radio right on my lunch. And they said that on the Bay Area toll, because you guys know I don't drive over the bridge. Um, my family lives in San Leandro, and I live in Stockton, so there's no need for me to go over the Frisco Bridge. <sighs> Y'all, I just found out since they were fake news. The fucking bridge don't even have cash options to pay to go over the bridge. So, say if you drive over there, right, instead of, like, taking part or something, you can't give them money anymore. And the bridge toll has went up because my, my dad works over there. Um, you can't pay by money. You have to have fast track. Or they'll do it by your license plates, she said. Or by um, an invoice in the mail. Or pay as you go. Now that right there, mm, I don't like that. I don't like that. Because like, I grew up where we would stop on the bridge and, you know, say, hey, how you doing to the people. So I'm like, does that mean that those people lost their jobs? Because if there's nobody to take the money, there's probably just cameras there. Like, you know, it's always been cameras on the bridge. Don't get me wrong, but um you know they would have the options like oh you can go fast track or you can go just hand them the money boom, boom, boom. but now it's like they don't even need people anymore damn that's just sad you know i just i don't know it's getting more and more like distant from just human interaction and stuff like that so i'm like a little bit of human interaction is okay <laughs> plus those people in their job I can't, but yeah, I'm gonna go back in. To see what? To see what? Left, to the left, to the right, to the right, to the front, to the front, to the back, to the back. Hey. <laughs> okay, so I don't know if y'all can see that, but. I keep seeing threes and ones everywhere. Like yesterday, I checked out a bunch of people with one, one, ones and one in their um, total and a bunch of threes. So I was watching this video and they said those are like angel numbers, like your spirit guides are trying to tell you something and stuff like that. And y'all, it's kind of freaking me out <laughs> a little bit, just a little bit. Um, but yeah, I can't record too much because I am driving, but. I keep seeing threes and ones everywhere, and ciao. Woo! There we go. Hey you guys, so y'all know I love scents. So this is one of my favorite scents. It's by Chef Roble. I know, he's a chef. But I had got a sample of this like maybe, ooh, maybe three or four years ago. And I fell in love with the scent. So I found out they sell it on, guess what? ebay so the last two times i brought it i brought it from ebay and this seller i always buy it from i get the set i don't really need the gel because um the gel lasts way longer than the lotion the body butter the body butter is thick too and i love that um and then the, of course the scent it's a 1.7 ounce bottle so it's pretty good i'm gonna open it and show you what the bottle looks like but y'all this smells so good all right you guys so this is what the bottle looks like um in my hand my hand's not massive but it's a pretty good size bottle i like the shape of the bottle because it's like different and you know it's not like the traditional square or circle shaped bottles but it does smell really good so if you guys are looking for some new scents to try um i would definitely say this is one of the good ones um once again it does tell you on the back i believe what um no, it doesn't actually. But you can look it up and see what the notes are in the scent. It's kind of hard to explain. It's not super duper florally, but um, it does smell super good. It says spark sparkling signature cocktail notes on top, invigorating and resistible to creation is completed by sublime, alluring dessert notes for a lasting sensual gourmet finish. Now, I don't know about all that. But it does have a little bit of a sweet scent to it, and it does smell really good. So once again, it's called Click by Chef Roble. And I think he was on, uh, what's that show, Jesus? On um, Bravo. Top Chef. Duh, obviously. 
Um, <laughs> he was on there a few years back. So, uh, if you want to look into it, feel free to screenshot it or what have you.